think that there's an easy refuge that's taken in the journalistic fiction of the, of the vantage point of neutrality being a wise one. Um, objectivity, obviously, is a wise one uh, and, and a useful one. But certainly, let's say, neutrality in the face of genocide seems to me to be obscene. It's a kind of complicity. Um, if you say, on the one hand, there are people who believe that there should be, that this following subgroup of humanity should be systematically exterminated and that it's fine, and in fact a utopian project, and on the other hand, there are people who say this is unjust. Time will tell who is true. Um, I think you all see the preposterousness of that. But, but nevertheless, in a subtle way, there's a kind of insidious, again, letting us off the hook that this neutrality creates. And, and that part of our job, as I say, is not just to imagine and not just ultimately to speak, but to think along the way and to try to ultimately pass a lot of judgments. There is no accurate reporting that isn't also based on a series of very difficult judgments. And that's why I think that it actually is a worthwhile activity, even though um, it has a kind of existential futility in the short term from a kind of activist's point of view. The activist's urge to say, I will go, I will make visible what is invisible, I will speak for those who are voiceless, and things will change, uh, is, going, is going to almost always end in a certain level of frustration. Uh, the history of wars is, is pretty much inseparable from the history of humanity. And I think that conflict will be with us. And then you can say, well, if conflict's going to be with us, and if horrible things are going to perpetually happen, why do this? Uh, that, that's not quite sufficient, because I think that there is a cumulative effect in the overall balance that if we stopped what we're doing, the world would be worse. In other words, doing what we do may not visibly make the world better all the time. But I think you can argue that stopping doing what we do would make the world very much worse. And, that, and if you believe that at all, if you agree with me on that, that means that you have to accept that there is some sort of value in the kind of long-term value in the cumulative power of truth-telling.